When you do reward training, the basic training sequence is always one, two, three, four. I mean, pretty easy to remember. Number one, you request your dog to do it. Number two, you lure the dog to do it. Number three, the dog does it. Then number four, you reward the dog. You say thank you and you, you maybe give a food reward. You use the lure to get the dog to do what you want. You see, the dog doesn't speak English. It's, it's as good as saying Rover sit as it is saying Sientate or Lete Chai, Pezi Pezi. If the dog doesn't speak English, he doesn't know what you want, so he can't do it. So we use the lure to teach basically English as a second language. Once the dog's got the idea, we phase out the lure. And so now we're only using food as a reward when he gets it right, but also we want to phase that out pretty quickly because it's a pretty ineffective reward as the puppies get older and develop new interests. So you want to replace food rewards with life rewards. The things that mean the most to your puppy, like coming up on the couch, sit on the couch, sit, you get a tummy rub, sit, I'll throw the tennis ball for you, sit, I'll open the door, you can leave the house or get in the car, and sit, I'll, I'll give you a supper too.